Outstanding food, the band was out of this world, the sans chicken was just heavenly, the egg rolls melted in my mouth, and the war wonton soup was orgasmically good. Just stay away from the fried rice. It pains me to say it was terrible. I ended up throwing most of it away. Number 2 Holders Mission City Grill Not from this area from SoCal, and man this place is bomb for breakfast, had the Mexican coffee great way to start my Sunday shared it with the husband. He got chicken and waffles that wasn't on the menu, but they said they still make it the chicken was so crispy, even our son ate some of the chicken. I got the Florentine omelet, and it's so good, and the hash browns nice and crispy the way it should be. Number 3 Din Tai Fung Finally got in after days of waiting trying to reserve online. My suggestion to anyone would be to walk in, and have an average wait time of 20 to 25 minutes. We were glad to be the first batch, when it opened at 10 am, and finished our brunch by 10.45 am. The restaurant lives up to the expectations undoubtedly. Number 4 Pizzicato A Chicago The food was delicious. Reminded my family and I of pizza we had in Chicago, and a small pizza place in Arizona. Wings were good. The sauce wasn't spicy, but it was still flavorful. The only drawback was the service. Somewhere between being seated and our food arriving to our table our waiter changed. There was a lack in communication which hindered services for a while. Number 5 Taplands Good size, dog-friendly, patio. Shaded and partially heated. Nice and spread out for the pups. Beer selection is great and always changing. They do a very good job of keeping a lot of different styles on tap. Check out their homepage for the current tap list. Number 6 Armadillo Willie's Barbecue. Portions are way too small for what they charge. Quality of ingredients was good. But overpriced way overpriced for what you get. I will not return to this restaurant. The coleslaw peanut slaw was okay it was delicious, and the taste of the meat was delicious, but there just was not enough. Number 7 for Nayo Santa Clara. Absolute horrible service. I have never experienced such awful service in my 34 years of life. Food was okay. Cold. Seemed like it was sitting under a heat lamp for too long. Drinks were near impossible to order. Such an awful time and experience. Will not be back. Too bad cause the restaurant itself is gorgeous. Number 8 Hironori, Craft Ramen. Definitely one of the top ramen places I've been to. As a vegetarian, ramen can often be hit or miss. The vegan ramen was outstanding. The broth was very tasty, and I love how they add soy protein to make it very filling. I recommend making a reservation through Yelp as this place is very busy. Overall highly recommend. Number 9 Ramen Nagi Christmas shopping equals having a friend wait in the Ramen Nagi line while I shop. P.S. Friend got in line around 4.20 p.m. on the Sunday right before Christmas. While we weren't at the very front of the line, when it opened, we were still seated within 15 minutes of opening. A lady walking past had asked my friend and I how the food was, and we told her it was both our first time here. Number 10 Achilles Oh man this is the place I want after a few drinks. It always satisfies the drunchies. We loved getting the chicken shawarma, lamb shawarma, and lots of white sauce. The guys are always super nice and friendly inside. Pickup is easy and fast. I've never had to wait for my order when I place it online. Hope you like this video for more videos please subscribe to our channel.